Okay, so this video is not financial advice. I'm not a financial planner. I'm an entertainer, the one and only eight father on the recliner. Wow! So I just wanted to show you. I don't know if you're going to be able to see this clearly. Okay. So, Tendy Time is giving out all my personal information. Hey, can you come closer? All right, so this is Tendy Time's number. 706-461. Hold on. 7609. So as you can see, he started texting me back October 10th of 2021. Here, I guess he was showing me some of the shares that he owned, which as you can see is not much. I think he bought one share. Let me see. If you can see that. Four shares, one share. So this total, total amount of shares he bought over here is about probably 10 shares. Okay, but he could come up with unlimited uh, amount of money. Remember he said that? He says, I could come up with any amount of money, whether it be 50000 a 100000 a million dollars. He could come up with it. He bought about 10 shares. Okay. So now, let's see. Here's the text message. So, now, so once again, it's starting from October 10, 2021. Okay. Hey, Richie. Let me see if I can open this one up here. Wait. Hey, Richie. This is Corey Jones, Tendy Time. If you want to do an interview or phone call, whatever you want, call it. I'm into it about how we need to come together as a team and set up our disagreements aside until after the squeeze or whatever. I agree with 95% of what you tell people to do, just how you go about it. Okay, whatever, let's say. Let me say, I gotta get back to it. Give me one second. All right, tendy time. Okay. So let's go all the way back. So you see, you see all these text messages. So after that, here's another text message from tendy time. I had 85 shares by June. Unfortunately, things came up and I had to sell 10 shares, but have since bought them back. I'm 32 years old with three kids, 13, 12, and eight. I'm just trying to give them the life I didn't have. Regardless, if you want to do some content, we are going to take off very soon, brother. Uh, you'll enjoy your Sunday. All right, so I'm just going to go one by one with this. Okay, to show you that this is Tandy Times YouTube. I'm sorry, not YouTube, forgive me. His cell phone. All right, I see. Not sure what this is here. He wanted me to watch some of his videos, I guess. He posted that. Here's him probably buying another 10 shares. All right. I'll be ready in about 30 minutes. All I ask is in the beginning, I want to tell them a little bit about me. I'll be short and sweet. Now, this is the time when I agreed to help Tendi Time to make him a video, okay? Sorry, I didn't have service. This is all Tendi, you understand? It's This is not his 12-year-old daughter. This is Tendi time texting me all of these messages. Sorry, I didn't have service. I sent that earlier. I'll be ready in 10 minutes. Okay, now this is a video I originally wasn't, wasn't going to show, but now I'm going to show it, okay? So after I did the video with him, this is his son thanking me. I don't, let me play that one more time. It's kind of low. It's kind of hard to hear. But this is Tendi Time thanking the ape father for helping his father. You want to say? Thank you for what? For trying out again. Yeah, this is the second time. Remember, you, had him, you wrote him in that other video and you didn't have service? All right, we're going to do an interview. I'll be back in a little bit, but I love you. Okay, now all of these messages, I'm ready when you are. Then he complained that he said two people unsubscribed. Maybe they you're your, your haters, <laughs> whatever. Okay, this is all tendy time. You follow me? Okay, so 
All this good luck, brother. After the Moaz, I'm going to be able to afford to eat healthy. And I hope you do also. We got to get uh, right to be able to enjoy our children's lives. Does this look like a 12-year-old girl? Does this look like a 12-year-old girl? Okay. So let, let's keep it going. No, let's keep it going. Okay. Any ideas I got that I think could help get the message further? I'll let you know ASAP because you got a bigger reach, man. I wish we could get just 1,000 of your subs to subscribe over here, meaning to Tendi Times channel. So there's right there, Tendi is starting to now show his true colors, the cloud chaser that he is, okay? All right, whatever. What is he saying here? Just think I could be a greedy bastard and keep all those secrets to myself. But that won't help the squeeze. It's coming soon, brother. I don't know about you, but I'm struggling, but not much longer. I just, this is where he's starting to tell me that his life is very hard. I'll make a video about how stupid it was. Maybe because, like I said, I bought in at nine and then, uh, whatever, sold six shares. Uh, this is him just basically trying to justify why he sold shares. Um, this is him always, he's always asking me to like, look at his videos, you know, you know, would you ask your people to check out my videos? I'd appreciate it, brother. Now, see, now this is where I it started to get like a little annoying because the guy was texting me kind of like on a daily basis. I said, Tendi, I promise you from time to time, I'll give you shout outs. Keep up the good work. There's just a lot of people I got a shout out, brother, because the guy was all over me, basically like bees on honey. Okay. Okay, here, look. Thanks. I'm going to try to have really funny videos out later today. Enjoy your Sunday, my brother. Okay, so 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 far, what are you seeing from all of this? You're, you're seeing a guy who's admitting that he's struggling with his family. You're seeing a guy who's reaching out to the ape father for help. Okay, just give me one second here because my battery is low. I got to put the uh, display to brightness a little bit more. Okay. So what are you seeing? You're seeing a guy asking the ape father for help, okay? So let's check this out. Yeah. Oh, this is Tandy time. And just a reminder, in case you forgot last week, you said in a video you were going to start shouting out true fans. I'm not saying anything about me. Yeah, he just wants me to shout him out. This is this constant cloud chasing. He's been doing this for several months. So like I said, what was the beginning? Look. Look, what was the beginning? October what? What was that, 10, 2021? Okay, so let's see where we are. Let's move forward. Okay, so here's October 24th. Let's just look at dates. Look at all these messages. November 9th. December this, does this look like, yeah, this is a 12-year-old girl, right? This is a 12-year-old girl speaking, right? Look, that's a 12-year-old girl, right? I never saw a 12-year-old girl that had hair all over her face, right? That's a 12-year-old girl. It sounded to me like he said it was a distraction, and I'm starting to think he's a plan. I don't know. I think he was talking about Lou. He wasn't a Lou fan for a very long time. Uh, anyway, now he's complaining about how his life is struggling, I'm trying to figure things out. My wife lost her job last week. Yeah, that's a 12-year-old girl talking. <laughs> I guess the 12-year-old girl has a wife who lost her job, right? Okay. Now, this is where me and Tendi started to kind of get into fights. See? Look. I, this is me talking to Tendi. This is what he started to do is cloud chasing. So, I guess this was about my wife. This is, this is me speaking. It is so fucked up what you did. You know, my wife has stage four breast cancer. My son has autism. My mother had a triple bypass. My father passed away. You attack me like this, calling me a fraud, a con man. It is so fucked up. I helped you. Your son thanked me. This is how you treat me. My shares, meaning he wanted to know how many shares that I have, are none of your business. My father's estate is none of your business. Just like your family affairs or your past, which I believe he actually told me on the phone that at one point he was in, in jail, okay, or he was on drugs. That was his words, not mine. 
But I even said, that's none of my business. I hope you just make a simple video saying the following, okay? I was never arrested or charged with fraud. My father's estate is set up as a trust for my kids. This is none of your business. How would you feel if I made a video talking about your relatives that passed away, okay? Just make this right because this shit is going to get bad. I understand you want to grow your channel, but to attack me with lies is not the right way to build your channel. So this is around the time when Tendi started to make up all these lies about me, you know, saying that I stole my children's inheritance. And, you know, he went on this uh, rampage, basically, because he wants, as you can see, he's a cloud chaser. He wants to get subs. OK, so let's see. Okay. So now this is where Tendi starts automatically. Now, isn't it coincidental that he starts doing this around the time that he's attacking me? In other words, he's attacking me, okay, attacking my father who passed away, saying that I stole my children's inheritance. Now, all of a sudden, he's a 12-year-old girl. So let's read these texts. You must, have, you must have the wrong number. My daughter is 12 years old. Now, here's a funny thing. Why would he say my daughter is 12 years old, right? So if this was a 12-year-old girl speaking, she would, she would just say, I'm 12 years old, right? Are you starting to read between the lines? He's, right here, he just caught himself in a lie. He said, you must have the wrong number. He says, my, here's the key word, my daughter is 12 years old. So don't you understand this is Tendi time talking? This is Tendi time pretending. He just, The guy is so stupid that, that he doesn't even realize he just caught himself in a lie. If this was really a 12-year-old girl speaking, she wouldn't say my daughter is 12, year old, 12 years old. Would you agree? She would just say I'm 12 years old. Okay, so let's read that one more time. You must have the wrong number. My daughter is 12 years old, and she said you have been sending her foul messages, so I assume you must have the wrong number, so please don't contact this number again. Okay, whatever. So now, here's an example. Does this sound like a 12-year-old girl? Who in the fuck are you? 